most of our young men, deep down inside, know why they're here. They know they need it, and they're, and they're here because they want to be here, okay? They want discipline, they want structure, they want to be helped on their journey towards getting better and becoming better students. There's no separation from the academic to the athletic. I use teaching analogies on the field with our, with our players. I use athletic analogies in the classroom with the kids all the time. You know, it's what these guys understand. So the first thing I'm going to do to walk with them side by side is, you know, I'm going to speak their language. And once they understand, the, the, you know, from the, the position that, you, that you're coming from, then they can easily, more easily and more readily assimilate, you know, the, the point you're trying to communicate. Because of Bridgeton, I think I've become a better person, a better individual. Um, I take more, things more serious now. I'm more structured. Uh, I look at things in a, in a realistic sense now. Um, Bridgeton has helped me become, in the short time I'm here, a better person. The first time in my life I feel like I'm actually accomplishing something now that I'm at Bridgeton. I mean, um, I always, I had that feeling on the field. I never really had it in the classroom or about myself as a person, but ever since I've been here, all of that's come together. There's an old quote that if you want to soar like an eagle, you've got to, you've got to hang with the eagles. You've got to be with those, those people that are going in that direction. Well, that's what it's all about. These kids are all people going further in their life. No matter what their past has, these people have not sat back and accepted that they can't have successes in their future. And they're going to make Bridgeton that bridge or that stepping stone or whatever it happens to be to the next level of success that they have. And many times that's why we look so much better when they look back at us and they realize, gee, without that year, same for myself, I'm afraid to figure out where I might have ended up. What would I have done? Because I think I would have sold myself short, and I think a lot of our graduates feel exactly the same way. They had a whole lot more to offer, and Bridgeton gave them the chance to kind of lay that out there. My high school coach is nothing like Coach Marcella. He didn't care about me as an individual. He just cared about the team. And Coach Marcella just really, he tries to help you in other ways just other than football. I mean, uh, he's, he's also my math teacher, and um, he saw that I had trouble and he immediately started helping me with my math as well as my football. He'd, even in, while we were on the field, he talked a little bit about my homework and my math tests and stuff like that. Marcella is a, is a very, very intellectual individual. He's a great person. First year I ever met him, it's not like he's my coach over four years, so I got to know him, but in a short time that I know him, he's a great person. Help you out anything you need. Get you to show off his back if he had to, but he's a great person. BA gave me an opportunity to be successful. I, I honestly think that if it wasn't for Bridgeton Academy, I, I wouldn't be the same person I am today. And I thank the, uh, the coaching staff for guiding me along my life. And, uh, you know, but I think because of Bridgeton Academy, you know, I, I'm going to be able to uh, graduate from Northeastern in four, four years, four or five years, you know. These are so many of our kids, uh, many of them are here just for a year of seasoning. Others are here because they've uh, been inconsistent students. They have intellectual abilities, but have not uh, worked consistently from quarter to quarter, from year end to year beginning to year end maybe. All of those things together, the academic, athletic, and just the social awareness and just the general maturity of, uh, of each of our young men uh, is something to behold. I'll never forget standing right out here outside the gym because you remember we used to have graduation in the gym. And uh, this parent uh, thanked me for working with their son and, uh, and all of us and, and uh, said, I, I sent you a boy and you gave me back a man. Just the, you know, boys take a little longer to get the idea. <laughs> but once they do, whew, they're off. D-O-P-S-O-N-E-B-E-O-N-E-B-E-O-N-E-B-E-O-N-E-B-E-O-N-E-B-E-O-N-E-B-E-O-N-E-B-E-O-N-E-B-E-O-N-E-B-E-O-